Hello students, today we are going to learn about austenitic stainless steel. Austenitic stainless steel is the most common type of stainless steel. Some of the properties of this steel are it is non-magnetic, it is highly corrosion resistant, it has good combination of strength and ductility, it has good formability and weldability, and as far as working temperature range is concerned, it can be successfully used from cryogenic temperatures to the red hot temperature of furnaces and jet engines. Now students, if we see iron iron carbide phase diagram, ferrite is the stable microstructure at room temperature. So the question is how austenitic structure in austenitic steel is stable at room temperature. The answer to this question is that there are some elements called as austenite stabilizers. The function of these elements is to increase the austenite field so that it is stable even at room temperature. These austenite stabilizers include nickel, manganese and nitrogen. On the basis of stabilizers added, austenitic stainless steel can be divided into two series. So students, now we are going to discuss about 200 series of steel. 200 series of steel, we have nitrogen and manganese which are added as austenite stabilizers along with nickel. This is a class of highly corrosion resistant austenitic stainless steel. It is also known as chromium manganese stainless steel. Over the last few years, students, the price of nickel has been relatively high. There has been an interest in low nickel or no nickel steel and chromium manganese stainless steel serves that purpose pretty well. The applications of 200 series austenitic stainless steels ranges from dishwashers and washing machines to cutlery items to structural and decorative parts of the automobile. Okay, my dear students, after having a knowledge of 200 austenitic stainless steel, the next series of austenitic stainless steel is 300 series. 300 series are chromium nickel alloys that achieve their austenitic microstructure almost exclusively by nickel alloying. Some very high alloyed grades include some nitrogen to reduce nickel requirements. 300 series is the largest group and the most widely used. Due to the addition of nickel in 300 series, these austenitic stainless steels are expensive than 200 series austenitic stainless steels. Some of the most common austenitic stainless steel in this series include Type 304. The best known grade is Type 304, also known as 188 and 1810 for its composition of 18% chromium and 8 to 10% nickel respectively. Type 316, the second most common austenitic stainless steel is type 316. The addition of 2% molybdenum provides greater resistance to acids and localized corrosion caused by chloride ions. Both of these types have a low carbon percentage variant which have low carbon contents below 0.03% and are used to avoid corrosion problem caused by welding. These are named as 304L and 316L respectively.